Welcome, young space explorers, to a grand adventure through the cosmos. Today, we embark on an extraordinary journey into the heart of our wondrous solar system, where we'll meet the magnificent planets that dance around our brilliant sun. So, fasten your seatbelts and let your imagination soar as we take off on an interstellar expedition. Our cosmic quest begins with the closest planet to the sun, a fiery orb of scorching temperatures and swirling storms. Mercury. Named after the Roman messenger god, this little planet zooms around the sun faster than any other. It's a true speedster in the solar system. Venus, the dazzling sister planet of Earth. Its radiant beauty hides a scorching secret, where temperatures soar to unimaginable levels. Beneath the alluring clouds of sulfuric acid lies a world of extremes, providing valuable insights into the delicate balance that sustains life on our own planet. Earth, a haven of life and natural wonders, Earth is the third planet from the sun and the only one known to support life. From its diverse ecosystems to the vast oceans and lush forests, our planet is a testament to the astonishing complexity and harmony of nature. The breathtaking beauty and boundless diversity of Earth, a precious gem floating in the vastness of space. Now brace yourselves for a planet known for its striking red appearance, Mars. This rusty, dusty world has fascinated astronomers for centuries and perhaps one day it might even become a second home for humanity. Hold on tight as we zoom towards a colossal stormy planet, Jupiter. It's the biggest of them all with a colossal great red spot, a massive hurricane-like storm that's been raging for centuries. Next up, the giant with a magnificent set of rings, Saturn. Oh, how it sparkles and shines in the distant skies. Saturn's rings aren't made of diamonds, but they sure do look like it, don't they? ready for an ice-cold adventure on Uranus and Neptune. These distant ice giants have chilly atmospheres and are so far from the sun, they might need a cozy space jacket. we reach the last of our celestial companions, the furthest planet in our solar system, Pluto. Although not considered a full-fledged planet anymore, Pluto still captivates our hearts with its charm.
Animals and desert foxes live in deserts where it's super hot. Ocean. Wild animals like dolphins and sharks live in the ocean. Fun fact. Did you know polar bears live where it's freezing cold? Their thick fur keeps them warm. Part 3. Types of wild animals. Carnivores eat meat. Animals like lions, tigers, and wolves are carnivores. Herbivores. Herbivores eat plants, leaves, and grass. Elephants and giraffes are great examples. Omnivores. Omnivores eat both plants and animals. Bears are omnivores. They eat berries and fish. Part 4. Why are wild animals important? Balance in nature. Wild animals help keep nature balanced. If there were no lions, there might be too many deer. Pollination. Animals like bees and butterflies help plants grow by spreading pollen. Food chain. They're part of the food chain, keeping everything connected. Part 5. Amazing wild animals around the world. The fastest animal. The cheetah is the fastest land animal. It can run up to 70 miles per hour. The biggest animal. The blue whale is the biggest animal on Earth. It's as long as two school buses. The smartest animal. Dolphins are super smart. They can solve puzzles and communicate with clicks and whistles. The smallest animal. The bee hummingbird is the smallest bird in the world. It's as tiny as a coin.
Our solar system is like a big neighborhood in space, and it has one big star right in the middle, that's the sun. The sun is super important because it gives us light, heat, and energy. Around the sun, there are eight planets, and each one is different and unique. Let's take a closer look at these awesome planets. First, let's meet the inner planets, the ones closest to the sun. Mercury. This is the smallest planet and the closest to the sun. It's really, really hot during the day, but super cold at night. Venus. Venus is about the same size as Earth, but much hotter. It has thick clouds that trap heat, making it the hottest planet in our solar system. Earth, that's our home. Earth is the only planet we know of that has life, water, and plants. It's just the right distance from the sun to be warm, but not too hot. Mars. Mars is the red planet because of its reddish soil. Scientists are super curious about Mars and wonder if there could be life there one day. Now, let's visit the outer planets, which are farther from the sun and much bigger. Jupiter. Jupiter is the biggest planet in our solar system. It has a huge storm called the Great Red Spot that's bigger than Earth. Saturn. Saturn is famous for its beautiful rings. These rings are magic of ice and rocks and they're super cool to look at. Uranus. Uranus is a chilly planet and it spins on its side. It's different from all the other planets because of this unique tilt. Neptune. Neptune is a dark blue planet that's really far away. It's super cold and windy out there. Dinosaurs were giant reptiles that lived millions of years ago, long before humans ever existed. They lived during the Mesozoic era, which had three periods. Triassic, the beginning. Jurassic, where dinosaurs got bigger. Cretaceous, the age of giant dinosaurs. Dinosaurs ruled the Earth for over 165 million years. There were so many kinds of dinosaurs. Here are some cool ones. Tyrannosaurus rex, T-Rex, the king of dinosaurs with sharp teeth. Triceratops, the three-horned plant-eating giant. Brachiosaurus, a super tall dinosaur that ate leaves from treetops. Velociraptor, small but super smart and speedy. Stegosaurus, it had plates on its back and a spiky tail for protection. Which one is your favorite? Let us know in the comments. Dinosaurs ate all kinds of things. Carnivores like T-Rex ate meat and hunted other dinosaurs. Herbivores like Brachiosaurus ate plants, leaves, and trees. Omnivores like some smaller dinosaurs ate both plants and animals. Their sharp teeth or flat teeth helped them chew their favorite foods. Dinosaurs lived all over the world, in jungles full of tall trees, in swamps with lots of water, even in deserts with hot sand. Earth looked very different back then. There were no cities, no roads, and definitely no humans. But wait, if dinosaurs lived so long ago, how do we know about them? Scientists called paleontologists dig up fossils. These are the bones, teeth, and footprints of dinosaurs that turned into rock. They use these fossils to build skeletons and imagine what dinosaurs looked like. Isn't that cool? The next time you see a dinosaur skeleton in a museum, you'll know it's made from real fossil pieces. Dinosaurs ruled the Earth for millions of years, but one day they disappeared. Scientists think it was because a giant meteor crashed into Earth, creating big fires and blocking sunlight. The Earth became too cold for dinosaurs to survive. But don't worry, some animals, like birds, are related to dinosaurs. So in a way, dinosaurs are still with us. 
Dinosaurs were amazing creatures, and learning about them is so much fun. Which dinosaur do you wish you could see in real life? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon for more exciting adventures. See you next time, little dino explorers.